assalamu alaikum dear student in today's lecture we will discuss how sponges can reproduce uh, in previous lecture we already discussed um, we already discussed in detail about phylum porifera uh, but in today's lecture we will discuss how the sponge can reproduce and uh, either uh, they can reproduce by sexual or asexual reproduction here you can see uh, is a body of a sponge which is present in aquatic ecosystem it could be marine or it could be fresh water uh, so here is a sponge and uh, this sponge the gametes will be produced inside the sponge and it can reproduce either sexual or asexual reproduction in sexual reproduction the uh, maybe the sponge uh, release the sperm first or egg first but both the gamete will be released at the same time so here is a male uh, uh, sponge which released the sperms in the water and at the same time the other sponge will be released egg or ovum uh, or maybe the male uh, uh, gamete which is a sperm as you can see on the screen will be move in the female gamete um, in female body and it will enter in their special cells which are called quanocytes and the sperm enter in quanocytes where the ovum is present and the fertilization the process of fertilization takes place inside the quanocytes here you can see these are the quanocytes and sperm will get entered in that cells where the ovum is already waiting for the sperm then uh, sperm will fuse with the ovum and the zygote will be developed and with the passage of time uh, cleavage the process of cleavage will be proceeded and zygote develop into embryo and then uh, as you know the development is indirect so larva will be produced which is parenchymula larva or amphiblastula larva uh, always keep in mind the larva of a porifera can move uh, but uh, the adult sponge is a sessile then uh, when it get mature the larva move out from the uh, parent body and uh, it settle on the bottom and develop into new sponge and they can also reproduce through uh, sexual reproduction which uh, is the form of internal bud bud which is called gamule uh, that's how uh, the sponges can reproduce they show uh, sexual and asexual reproduction and all the sponge are hermaphrodite and they develop proto androsperm then they show protogynous 